Cambridge A level Information Technology paper 4 for May June 2023 you have been supplied with the following source files I have the files here create a folder called examination You must save all the work in this folder, copy the files into this folder. So I will just copy all the files into the folder. So in this video I will be doing task 1 vector graphics. Create a copy of this image, use the following properties. I will be using Adobe Illustrator for this. Go to a new file create a new artboard so you can see we need to create a wheel with a diameter of 250 pixels and the thickness of the wheel or the tire width is 15 pixels so that means the outer circles diameter will be 250 and since this is 15 pixels thick so we need to subtract 15 plus 50 30 on both sides to get the inner circles diameter so it will be 220 pixels for the inner circle so let's create a uh, ellipse click on the artboard so you can set a circle with 250 pixels diameter set both width and height as 250 pixel give ok now another one with 220 pixel because the tire width is 15 pixel so 15 plus 15 30 should be subtracted from 250 so 220 px you can keep it with the centers intersecting Now go to Pathfinder tool and minus front. So we got the wheel shape. Now the color of the width wheel is 505050 hex code. So select this, go for color. So this is 5050. Five zero, give okay. Now we need to create a spoke like this, which is the width is fifteen pixel, and the color is same color given. So the width is fifteen pixel, and the height will be the diameter of the circle. So let's add a rectangle whose height is 250 pixels sorry height is 250 pixels and width this 15 pixel give ok so we got a rectangle like this now let's use the rotate property so select the rectangle click on rotate you can see the center of rotation here in the center of this one press alt button and click on this you will get a window like this so we can rotate this here we have three spokes like this so you know the central degree is 360 degree of the circle we need three spokes so 360 divided by 3 it should rotate by 120 degree so give 120 and give copy so you will get another copy here press ctrl D to get one more copy at the same distance or same angle so we got the three spokes here you can select this and group it You 
can see the wheel is on the top the tire is on the top so let's bring this on top right click arrange bring to front now we need a hub in between and its diameter is 30 pixel and the color is given so add a circle So the diameter I have given 30 pixel, give ok. Now the color is FF0000, give ok. Now you can move this here. So this is done. Now you can group all of this. Right click group. Now let's export. File export as the name is basic wheel followed by your center number and candidate number and it must be SVG file. So in this folder inside examination basic wheel followed by your center number and candidate number and make sure it is SVG export ok next edit your basic wheel file to create this image so the image should be edited to look like this note that the following features of the spokes and the hub so it should look like this So I'll ungroup this. And this also will be ungrouped. I'll remove this. So we need to make it this way. Let's start with the half of the spoke. So I will remove this also. Let's give a rectangle whose height will be 125 which is half of 250 here and so the width will be 15 let's give 15 and height will be 125 it's a lighter gray and we need to give a little more wider spoke here and the color is a lighter gray give ok I'll keep a copy of this here now I'll use the curve tool to curve it little bit like this and so after curving it will look like this now we need to curve in the middle this way so that's done now decrease the width of this give black color And this one also you need to curve
let's go like this now you need to curve it according to this and here you need to curve according to this curve use the direct selection tool so that it will touch here touch here So we got the spoke in this shape. Now let's group this group. I'll make a copy and rotate this. I have made another copy which looks like this. Now let's group it. We need to reduce the height a little bit. So I have reduced the height to almost 228 pixel. Now you can see if you place it you will get as it is required in the question. So now let's like we did for the previous one let's make three spokes of this. Uh, select the spoke go to the rotate tool the center of rotation is here press alt and click on it. You can give 120 degree as we gave before click on copy press ctrl D so that we get another copy of it placed at 120 degree let's group this Now instead of the hub, uh, instead of the circular hub, we have to add a hexagon here. So let's add the hexagon. Go to polygon tool, click here. The sides must be 6 and let's give the radius 50. Now resize it and the color must be A dark yellow so we have placed the spoke as required so you can see this is the required wheel let's group it before we export so select all, right click, group. Now let's export this as new wheel and SVG format. So file, export, export as new wheel followed by your center number and candidate number. And make sure it is SVG export
so the graphics creation is done the next task is animation which will be uploaded in another video you can find the link in the description once it's uploaded thank you for now